that's kind of my big concern. Let's get everybody back to where we were before. While the new normal is a term used by many in the wake of COVID-19. We gotta just do the, the bump. You know. North St. Paul Mayor Terry Furlong is one of the few who says he wants to get back to the old normal, what life was before COVID. Here's my, my little mayor's room. I'm trying not to use it. Uh, and he is playing a part in bringing routine back to the city, visiting with the community during Monday with the mayor, as well as resuming in-person city council meetings. As you can see, we're doing the social distancing. The city also acted to protect businesses during the shutdown and after reopening. It was license period, we allowed them not to have to pay for that uh, license portion of that, of that time that they were closed. Uh, we also opened up the outside patio, outside sidewalk, to allow them to be able to serve outside because they're allowed to serve outside before they can serve inside. With long-established bars and businesses on 7th Street, North St. Paul has been a destination for shopping and nightlife. Jennifer Austin, owner of Main Drag Vintage and Collectibles, formerly Schlecken Company, says business has been booming since they reopened on June 8th. People are eager to be shopping and back, feeling back to normal, and so that helps a lot. And then also because they, we did have a following. Um, we did have customers that were looking for us and interested in coming back and seeing us. So um, that helped a lot. Although the annual History Cruise Car Show, which drew large crowds to North St. Paul, has been canceled this year, Furlong says they're moving forward with several construction projects. A new apartment complex being built downtown. We got the M&I Homes over on Anchor Block. And as he reflects on the past several months, he says he's proud of the way the community of North St. Paul came together. I think we're a very tight community. We have a lot of history. Uh, people, people help other people and people help the businesses. And I saw that from day one.